you want to say hi to Twitch? Hey, Twitch. Hey. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> yeah. You make me happy when skies are grey. <laughs> Hello, cheeky face. Whoa. <laughs> Hello. Can Daddy have a kissy? <laughs> He's quite tired, huh? <laughs> What's that? The big <laughs> He's so tired, honey. <laughs> he is he is absolutely shattered. <laughs> yeah, I think that's when he's like, you know what, mum? It's uh it's definitely it's bedtime. Oh, it's feeding me my own brain. Oh. <laughs> I, I realized I actually don't practice uh, French quite enough, and it's mainly because I'm friends with Marine Lord. So I'm like, he puts me off them, you know, naturally. New dad, congrats. I mean, he's... Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, what's up? Oh, what's up, cheeky face? He's, uh, he's one year old. He, ju he just had his uh, one year birthday party last... yesterday. Oh, is Mama taking you to bed? Yeah, we're going to bed. Alrighty. Good night, Asta. So I've got. I was born to be a dad. Is that. That sounds like a nice compliment if I'm taking it the right way. You're English, but do you live that? You mean, in, do I live in Sweden? Yeah, absolutely do. Lord Dadimort. Exactly, exactly. Now, I, uh, you know, I, I never thought I'd enjoy being a dad quite this much, you know. it's uh, It's been fantastic, actually. Oh, we definitely need a bit more, uh... Yeah, maybe it's too much on wood too early. We'll see, we'll see. Aren't we technically all born to be dads? Yeah, sure, but, uh... Uh, actually... I... No, but I know what you're getting at. Oh, let's kill these two, just because they were close enough to be in a really good spot there, actually. I'm going for a pretty damn early wheelbarrow. I'm a big fan of the early wheelbarrow games. But you have no air. What do you mean, I have no air? You have no air. Air? Air. Like air to the throne? Of course not. You plonker. Oh, you guys haven't heard Marine Lord say it to me? When he's uh, talking about me uh, being bold and stuff, he pretty much defaults to one insult only. Because he hasn't got much to go on, you know? Like, when you have the tiniest dick on, on the planet. You you know you're... You know you can't really give back as good as you're going to get. Well, 
And so Marine Lord falls into this uh, this spot, unfortunately, where he's just going to get absolutely wrecked when it comes to insult wars. But he starts them every time. So it's like, what's wrong with you? Because he likes me. It, it is because he likes me. You're absolutely right. But he will not accept that, you know? He's what you call a plonker. Like, one time, I tried to organize with Marine Lord that he's going to, uh... Wait, what? Oh, did he make a wall down here? If so, that's really good by him. I think he did make a wall here. Yep. Well played. Okay, three knights should be enough to get something done. Unless we're a plonker. That is annoying. Buyers, isn't it? So what's he got here? Oh, Burgrave. Wow. Did you guys expect that? I didn't. Wow, that is very cool. And unexpected. I really didn't expect the Burgrave Palace. But relics are near him. Doesn't matter, he feels it's not the way forward this game, which... Hey, that's a choice that he's making right now, which is cool. Because now I'm like, what kind of game am I in? TP method, hello, hello. Thank you, thank you, my dude. Yeah, so we've absolutely butchered his uh, gold mining, right? So what can technically come out of this Burgrave Palace? Okay, five spearmen at a time. And that's something you have to respect with my little squad of knights. It certainly is. Okay, so we're getting a lot of food. A lot of gold. But... In fact, he's got a barracks and a Burgrave. Wow. Very interesting. 84 months? TP method. <laughs> I mean, yes, I, I do agree. Ah, I wonder if he went the barracks for the upgrade specifically. You know what I mean? That would make sense. That would actually super make sense. And you just use the Burgrave for um, producing the units themselves. Yeah, that makes that makes total sense to me. Attention. 
Pace, Bombe, Audi, Demilitaire, Sibalier. This is uh, a bit bad for him. Because even though these are age three men at arms, knights do soft counter them. So where are his spear boys, eh? Yeah, I mean, definitely an interesting strat. You can't deny that. Can't deny that at all. Now, do I want to keep hammering it down a bit? I think I do. Yeah, I mean, we're microing fine, keeping alive all our uh, knights, right? And soon, oh my god, I just realized we have Arbolateers next. But maybe I should upgrade these archers? I'll go for the upgrade on the archers, I think. First of all, getting the knight upgrades, just because they're the cheapest ones for us. So he does actually have the two-hander upgrade here. You can tell by the, the uh, big axe now that they have, which is obviously super cool looking. Soon. Yeah, we're going. For, we're going for that, and then we'll go for. We'll go for this. I think that's the way forward, team. You know what? I didn't even find my second deer pack. It's got. Yeah, okay, it's over there. I was about to say it's got to be over there because that's the only place we didn't scout. Okay, we have veteran horsemen now. That's fantastic. And soon, just about every unit that you can make will counter with arbiters, which is. Fantastic, right? Okay, so advantages. We're producing workers faster than him. Absolutely are. That's because we're French. Okay, we have this upgrade now soon. Yeah, it was a nice try by him. I thought it was cool. But now he's just, yeah, he's going to get slaughtered here now. Unfortunately for him. GG. Alrighty, that was cool, that was cool. That was cool. Very, very interesting play. Very interesting play. Oh, you saw the Viper do this yesterday as well? Who did he do it against? Because yeah, I thought the I thought the play was pretty cool. Like, uh, at first I was like, and a barracks? But then the barracks get that for upgrades, because if you get upgrades on the Burgrave, then you're just not utilizing the strength of the Burgrave, which is it being five barracks. So yeah, definitely a interesting game. And I'm happy I went French here, because my French does need a little bit of work. But I think overall that was, yeah, a fine, fine game, actually. A fine game.
Uh, but always fun to see somebody with something a little bit interesting, a little bit new.